how to use Google Keyword Planner without paying. Hi guys, welcome back to another video and in this video I'm going to be telling you how you can use the Google Keyword Planner tool for free. So having said that, let's just jump into the video. Now, if you know when you come over to Google Ads, they are Google Ads have the tool that we require which is the keyword planner but usually we can access that keyword without having to pay google right so in this video i'm going to show you how so first let's go ahead and click on start now all right first i'm going to show you how generally people do it right like how people would go ahead and set right so let's say this is our campaign all right we're going to go ahead and get more sales or leads to the website now we're going to click on next and then we're going to enter in our business name and over here you can add anything anyone uh, right like foxy fox and you can just simply click on next and you can enter in your website name right anything like that just simply click on next and once you're done you should be good to go right now they're asking us please come over here um people come here after they click your ad right desktop mobile you know whichever one you want to choose so i'm going to choose desktop and click on next and now we didn't find google analytics on your website but uh, we can skip that for now. Skip. Yeah, we don't need that. Then you just simply enter in all of these different details of your website, right? And then you enter in a number. So once you've entered in the number, you are good to go. So I'm going to go ahead and enter in my number and catch you guys in a second. Over here, we just enter in some keywords that are related to our uh, website, anything like that. We're just skipping these through so that I can show you uh, where you're doing things wrong. So let's say we want to go for um, New Zealand, right? Then we simply click on next and then we select a budget option. All right. So we're going to go with this one, click on next and yeah, then click on next. And then over here, basically, this is the payment option that we have to confirm where we want to confirm our payments, right? we got to select all of that different options so that we can pay. But this is not what we're here to do. This is where people uh, end up paying Google and then they can't go back. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go back over here, go back to the very start and show you what you should do in order to avoid this uh, process. So it's very simple and it's easy to miss because that's what google wants you to do they want you to miss this option so that they can get the money out of you so you see all of these options are big bright and bolded so that you click on them they don't give you this option right here they don't make this bold because of course you choose this option you have the option of not paying zero of not paying any money to google so what we're going to do is we're going to switch to expert mode and over here as you can see again big bold letters big bold options to choose so that they can take your money right i mean granted so i mean it is their option but you know they should also highlight other options as well like this one create an account without a campaign now if you create a campaign right if you create an account with the campaign, you're going to have to pay for it. But if you create an account without a campaign, you don't have to pay for anything. So what we're going to do is we're going to choose that option over here. Boom. Uh, yeah, just simply click on submit. All right. I don't want any performance tips or anything like that. I'm going to click on continue and boom. Congratulations. You're all set. You're all done. Pretty simple, right? We didn't have to pay. We didn't have to enter in our credit card or debit card information and we are good to go. Then we just simply click on uh, explore options and yeah we are good to go so as you can see none of your ads are running your campaign ads and groups have been removed enable them by showing ads but we don't want that so we'll just hide that right so pretty simple now what we can do is we could come over here at the top we have a bunch of different options in the bar we have search report tools and words and settings so what we're going to do is we're going to click on tools and settings and over here we have keyword planner and we just simply choose that keyword planner option and we are in and this is where we can go ahead and use it right so pretty simple so now as you can see you can go ahead and use this uh, platform for free which is so cool so over here uh, discover new keywords get search volumes and forecasts we click over here we enter in uh, you know or paste the keywords or one word or phrase line that we want to search for so let's just say uh, nfts right so we we'll click on enter we'll click on get started and over here we can see all of it so we can see google uh we can choose where we want to location you know enter in our location we can see we have these many uh searches within this country right here we're going to close that over here let's say united uh states 
we'll target that and click on save so as you can see keyword nfts average monthly searches are about 100k to 1 million uh three month change zero y o y change so this is basically you know searches volume for the latest month of the same month of the previous year so basically compared to last year in july uh the keyword volume has gone up 900 percent the competition is very low so nfts competition is very low and the top page bid for this page is 138 rupees which is like half a dollar and the top page bid which is high range it's like 448 which is like around two dollars so as you can see we have it if you want to go with a different plan you can go with different so over here we can see google google and search partner so if you choose that we are gonna have uh, some different results but yeah now if we wanted to keyword plan over here we have keyword ideas as well we have forecasts and everything right so pretty simple and let's say if you wanted to change a keyword we wanted to uh you know get something else we let's say discover a new keyword we try to enter in meal delivery or leather boots or anything so let's go ahead and add that so let's say uh youtube automation and then we simply click on get results and over here we can see a bunch of different results so over here we can see uh youtube automations 100 to 1000k uh, average monthly searches year over year change is 900 percent competition is very low and the bid is very low as well that's like um 10 20 cents i believe and over here we can see the top bid as well so as you can see this is how we basically use the keyword without having to pay even a single dollar so absolutely free this is how you do it if you were wondering how you can get the keyword planner tool from google then this is how you basically do it again there are a bunch of other stuff so we can see the forecast of this uh word so over here let me just change the location united states you know change that get rid of this click on save and over here all languages and over here we have google and search partner we're going to choose that and up to all time right and then over here we add a keyword let's say we want to add uh cryptocurrencies right we click on save but we can't have to create an ad group this is basically what we're doing but our keyword plan over here we can add keyword plans so but yeah and then of course we have the keyword ideas over here and we are good to go let's go back actually you know and click on tools and go into the keyword planner again and then we have searches and volumes let's go ahead and add in cryptocurrencies click on get started and then we can see how many search results is over here so over here as you can see cryptocurrencies 100k to 1 million monthly average searches uh three months change uh basically it shows you know uh three months change shows a three months change in the search trend so currently it's zero percent but you get the idea so pretty simple that's how you do it just follow these videos step by step and at the end you will see how you can use the Google Keyword Planner for free without having to pay anything. So that is it for this video, guys. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, let me know in the comment sections down below, and I'll be sure to answer them as soon as possible. So having said that, I will catch you guys in the next video. And until then, take care and goodbye.